As always, this channel is focused on caring for your eyes, helping you prevent and manage silent eye blinding diseases. However, today our focus is on effect of diabetes on the eye. We will continue after the intro. Diabetes is a common medical condition that if not diagnosed early and managed, could have a devastating effect on a patient's overall health and eyesight. Diabetic patients must inform their eye care practitioner of their condition and blood sugar level before an eye examination is done. High blood sugar levels could lead to blurry vision or visual fluctuation with and without spectacles. This often leads to unstable spectacle lens prescription and visual discomfort. A diabetic patient should therefore ensure that his, her blood sugar level is stable and within the normal range before eye examination. A blood sugar level of less than 146 mg is ideal for an eye test. A complication of diabetes could in some cases leave a visible sign at the back of the eyes which may be detected during an eye examination. This condition is known as diabetic retinopathy. At an early stage, diabetic retinopathy causes retinal blood vessel damage resulting in blood or fluid leaks. At a later or advanced stage, the disease results in total blood vessel damage with the appearance of new fragile and weak retinal vessels and more blood leaks known as retinal hemorrhage. If diabetic retinopathy is not treated, it could gradually lead to significant vision loss or blindness. Although not every diabetic patient develops diabetic retinopathy, they are all at risk of developing it. To reduce the risk of developing this condition, diabetic patients should take a proactive step by visiting an eye care professional that is either an optometrist or an ophthalmologist for a regular eye examination which should be done yearly if the eyes are healthy and with no ocular complications. If not, it should be done more often or is advised by an eye doctor. Nevertheless, prevention, they say, is better than cure. I strongly advise that diabetic patients keep their blood sugar level under control by doing whatever it takes, for instance, eating healthy, exercising, visiting a general practitioner for medical checkups, and adhering to their medical advice and recommendations. However, diabetic retinopathy could be treated using laser or other medical approaches by an ophthalmologist. 